We're currently at the Short Springs State Natural Area in Tullahoma, Tennessee. We're gonna do a couple of hikes here, including the Machine Falls Loop. So let's get started. Okay, so we're starting the Machine Falls Loop Trail. It's about five miles, so let's get started. We're gonna cross the creek here. It's, we're gonna take our time and do it. I don't know if I can do it or not. I'm Just do it. What's the worst gonna can happen? Well, I'm not in the water. I got water. Okay, so I made it, so now it's Cornbread's turn. Oh, he makes it look so easy. Well, that's smart. Okay, this creek runs along the trail uh, so far for the trip. I don't know what it's gonna do later. Even though the leaves aren't out right now, it's still a very nice trail. Very nice day to be out. Machine Falls Loop Trail is about a five mile loop that includes Machine Falls, Adams Falls, Busby Falls, and Laurel Bluff Loop. We hiked to Machine Falls in late January and it was still pretty chilly with lots of ice in the shaded areas near the falls. I'm sure the hike out is beautiful in the spring, but it was still enjoyable with virtually no leaves on the trees. There are a couple of water crossings, so be prepared if the creeks are up. Get ourselves back in shape, huh? Yeah. It's been a while since we hiked. Yeah, it's been a while since we hiked, and we can both clearly tell the difference. Well, we've both been sick, too, so. Yeah. Okay, so we are a little out of practice, but as you can tell, the trail was up there. It's a little narrow through here, but we got it. still see some icicles there. It is a pretty chilly day. What do you think? It's beautiful. There's a couple of uh, little areas that's kind of sketchy to get here, but uh, we made it fine. <laughs> yeah, it's a chilly day. There's still some ice, but this view is definitely worth it. I'm going to see if I can go down there now. I would say do it. Yeah, Cupcake will stay put. Go down and try to get a few other angles. Beautiful area. You have easy access down to this waterfall. It's beautiful. You can still see some of the ice in the water in this waterfall. It's a little icy. I'm still heading that way.
uh, getting down to the base of the waterfall can be a little treacherous. So just kind of pick your path wisely. I got my feet a little bit wet, not much though, um, but it's definitely worth it to get down there to the base so you can get those photos of the waterfall straight on and it's beautiful. Run up him like he used to. <laughs> Okay, we're, we're at Rutledge Falls. Uh, it's a short distance away from Machine Falls Loop Trail. So if you're going there, you can easily come to this one. With Rutledge Falls though, keep in mind that this is private property. The property owners allow access down to the falls, but make sure and follow the signs. Don't leave any trash. Uh, respect the property owner's property. Well, that's going to wrap up this hike. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, please do so. Any comments, if you'll leave them below, we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Until next time, thanks for watching. See you soon.